Hey guys, um, and welcome back to like another talking talking video. And um, you guys probably can't tell with but when you guys have seen this, but as I'm making this video, I'm again making it on a very late notice. But um, but I just want to you know um, get more talking. You know, I feel like making make another video like this um, is appropriate compared to last week's video. So. Um, you guys know I've been I've been kind of in like a funk lately um, for a little bit now, and um, I'm trying to get myself out of it. You know, I'm trying to you know do things to help myself mentally and whatnot, and um, you know just that that that's why I just kind of want to talk about more about like you know what's bothering me like the most and whatnot. So, what is depression and anxiety? Um, it's something that all of us can deal with, all of us deal with, um, you know, because it's very common for people to go through depression and anxiety throughout their times in their life, and, um, you know, and yeah, it's just, you know, a big modern thing that, that people deal with. And, uh, I just thought I'd share, you know, um, how it has affected me and whatnot, and, like, mentally, and, um, and stuff like that. So, basically, I, um, like, I had, like, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I, I had, like, a happy childhood growing up, and I'm still growing up, but back, back a few years back, I had, like, um, a really good childhood, you know? Um, everything was going good, you know. Um, like I was the happiest I've ever been when I was younger, even though I was a bit more of a pain in the ass then. But <laughs> you know, um, yeah, I had a good childhood. A lot of good things going, you know. Um, you know, just living my life. You know, nothing really bad going on. Living a happy, healthy life. And um, so basically. Um, I didn't start changing until when I started experiencing loss and grieving with loss and and that's you know that that's a big thing that can cause depression and anxiety and um, but like even before I've been experiencing loss I've always have been an anxious person like I would have, have anxiety about the littlest things and I still do and um, Yeah, so I thought I'd share um, um, when my uh, grandpa passed away back in 2015, and um, I was about 10 at, at the time, and that was like my first time actually experiencing a close loss, um, and yeah, that was rough for a while, and uh, that was almost like six years ago now, but, um, you know, and, uh, yeah, sorry, I'm facing now, but, um, you know, and that took a really big toll on me, I was not doing so well in school, and I, and I, and I used to do well in school growing up, and I wasn't doing so well in school, um, and, and then it got, and then a year or so later, I got held back in fifth grade, and, and I took fifth grade twice, and um, I got bullied and harassed in my second year of fifth grade, and I um, dro dropped out and moved on to sixth grade, and it um, wasn't until two years later that's um, when my dad passed away, some of you guys know, some of you guys don't, but um, yeah, my dad passed away when I was 12, and back then I used to have a channel, um, back, back then I, I used to have a channel, a YouTube channel, that was going incredibly well, like, I had the best support, like, I was so grateful, like, I still do now, but, like, that first time was special, you know, because that was, like, my first YouTube channel was going really well, and then only, like, a few months after that, um, and then I was, like, and I was, like, I kept on posting videos because on that channel because that's what, what, what was like helping me like grieve with the loss you know 
and um, and that was in Tuffy Lens later that the channel got t got taken down because it was an old school email account or whatever. And so I was really bummed out about that, and um, I wasn't sure if I was ever going to have the motivation to come back to doing YouTube, YouTube again. And it wasn't until I made this channel back, you know, in 2019, and, um, and that's when I've been trying to get, to get back on the grind. Um, so, yeah. And I've you know, but when I started the channel, I was still in not a very dark place, and I just thought like I need to do something to like help me. And then coming back to YouTube wasn't like the first thing I thought of, but I was like, okay, I my mom got me a new camera for Christmas. I didn't get any camera stand. I, I I at least gotta try, you know. So um, that's what I did, and. Um, and then I, I started doing YouTube, YouTube again, and then um, again I, w I still wasn't in the best place, in, in the best mindset. I wasn't still in the best place in my life, and uh, that probably explains why the videos weren't as good because I wasn't putting as much effort as I usually would, you know. And um, and um, you know. Because you see, like, grieving and depression and anxiety affects everyone differently. And, um, it has affected me a lot in my life in the past, um, three years. And for the first time in three years as of now, I honestly feel happier than I ever have in the past three years. And that really means something to me, you know, because I have the support of my friends and family, you know, like, you, you, you guys know I have the support of Hunter, Jada, and you know, and n n numerous of other people, and um, yeah, and I just you know now I'm I'm like I'm at the point where like I'm starting to feel happiness again, but then like but then like again I start feeling this way again like later on you know like it's like. It's like a sneak. It's like a sneak attack, you know. Like one day I'll be happy, and then boom, it just hits you like out of nowhere, you know. And um, in the past few weeks, it has been hitting me a lot more than usual, um, you know. And and I, um, that's why I'm trying to fix my mindset, fix you know everything mentally and whatnot, because everything's going great, you know. Like everything's going fa fa fantastic. It's just what's going on in here, and. Um, and I can't really explain why, you know, um, I just, just I never have really had the best mindset and I'm trying to change that. And, um, but like I said, I always used to be a very anxious person about, about the littlest things and whatnot. So, um, and I just always, I just had, I would just always forget about, about, about like the, the little things and whatnot, and um, and um, yeah, just um, can't really put into words, but um, you know, like doing YouTube like helps me, and just you know, like I feel like for the longest time, I never really developed, you know, the comfort to be able to. Um, share with, with you guys, and I've gotten to that point where I, I, I love and appreciate you guys so much with, with all the those you guys have been giving. I feel like you know I should at least you know um, share what's been going on with myself, with me, in my head and whatnot, and that's why I, that I, I talk to you guys. So yeah, that's and I haven't really been focusing on making videos lately. That's why I've been kind of been making like these talk videos the past few weeks now. Um, but I've been trying to focus on, on school and whatnot, and um, I'm, gonna, I'm a little stressed about that too. I think that's also what's messing with me, is just I'm a little stressed with school and whatnot, and just life in general. Even though things are going fine, I just I just always think to, of the negatives, and I always, think, I always think for the worst. And I'm trying to tell myself, you know, okay, you need to quit doing that, and look for the positives, and 
just keep moving forward and whatnot. And, um, and so yeah, that's pretty much what's going on with me. Just depression and anxiety has just affected me a lot in the past three years. Um, like I can't even put into words how much it affected me and how much it, how much I'm still grieving with um, the passing of my dad. And like, like let me tell you guys this now. My dad passed when I was 12. I'm almost 16 now. Um, as of today, I turned 16 in five days. So um, I'm growing up until I'm going to be growing up to a young adult, you know. And um, I want to share my, you know, growing up journey with you guys. Because um, doing YouTube has really helped me with a lot of things. Like, YouTube is one of my favorite things to ever do in the world. And that's something that I never want to stop doing, ever. So, um, yeah, and, and that's why I'm trying to get back on making good videos for you guys. And I know the videos have been a lot better than they've ever been, in my opinion, since I came back. Because I've been, I've been looking at, I've been thinking and feeling a lot happier than um, I, I used to be, you know. And um, I also just want to talk about just depres depression and anxiety in general. You know, um, like I said, depression and anxiety affects a lot of people in the world. It affects all of us differently. We all, we, we all go, go through it differently, you know. And um, it's, um, and see, like, I, I, like uh, if there's anyone out there that needs the, the, this advice, I'll go ahead and say it. Like, I mean, I mean, yeah, I know there are a few out there who's not going to want to listen to a freaking 16 year old just making a video on YouTube about this stuff. But, um, but I'm being very, I'm being very serious and very for real. So, um, you know, like if you're if you're experiencing any loss right now or going th through anything that you that really brings you down and that you're scared of and whatnot just um just make sure that you um talk to the ones that you love the most that 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 you can trust about how you're feeling and if they are and if they are very supportive of you then they will then they will help you cuz that's Cause that's what exactly what my friends and family have done for me, you know. That's exactly what Hunter has done for me. That's exactly what Jada has done for me, you know. So just talk to them. Like whenever you're feeling down, like it doesn't matter if it's like every day, cause I have those days too. Just like send them a text or something. Just tell them how you're feeling. And um, and if you're and if you have if your friends and family support you that much, then they will help you. Um, I mean. Like, like, I'll put this out there too, like, I mean, you know, like, if you're feeling down and stuff, you don't necessarily have anyone to talk to, feel free to, you know, drop how you're feeling in the comments, and then I'll be more than happy to talk to you and try to help you, because I've been there, and I'm still going through it, you know, and I'm willing to help people, because I, I, I know and understand how much that meant to me when I had people help me. So I understand the feeling of being able to finally get help and, you know, talk to talk to anyone about this about this stuff, about or mental health and depression and anxiety and stuff like that. And so, you know, um, it's just it's a very it's just, it's, it's a very common thing, I feel like, but then just, like, there are times where it just, it feels odd, you know? Like, you don't f feel all there, and you just don't feel like you're living your life to the, what, the way you want to, you know? And, um, I feel like that's been me lately. Because I've told you guys I've been in a, in a, in a, in a funk and whatnot. And I'm so I'm doing new things to you know um, help me with that and try and stay positive. And then that's the thing, just stay positive, keep pushing forward. Because if you're going through this right now, trust me, you do have my word. You got this. Like, like I believe in you guys. That you guys can do so much for for the world. And you guys can. You guys just have so much potential, and um, I believe in you guys. And. Um, 
I used to lie, I just love and appreciate you guys so much and that you guys could do anything that you want to do. And, um, and, 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 and again, like, whatever you want to do, it's not, it's not going to come out of, it's going to, it's not going to be perfect right, right off the bat. It takes time. It takes practice. Now, technically, I've been doing YouTube for, like, over three to four years now. Um, and have I never been really that popular? No. But that's why you keep pushing forward. That's why you keep, you know, doing, doing what, what, what you love to do and keep putting hard work about something you're very passionate about. You know, and um, that's what I've been doing, and I believe that you guys can do anything that you guys want to accomplish too. So, yeah, I love you guys. So, um, but yeah, if you need anyone to talk to, talk to your friends and family. Um, I'm pretty sure that they can help you. Um, I'll let you. I'll even try to help you. I mean, I'll put up my. I mean, I'll put up my, like my socials right here. Um, just like, just like on any of that, you know. Hit me up. Um, well, I'll I'll put my socials at the end of the video, so that um, if you need someone to talk to, just hit me up, and I'll be, and I'll see it, and I'll respond as soon as I can, and I'll do my best to help. Um, I'll do my best to help you because I am seriously willing to help people. Because well, like I said, you know, I I understand how it feels, like the just the great feeling of being able to find help, and and you know, being able to feel loved and appreciated again and you know and I know I know that feeling it's it's incredible especially if you felt like you just been you know so depressed for like for such a long time like I have and um, you know and um, yeah so I know I've been ra ra rambling about this for a while now but um, you know just just if you're going through something like this right now just stay strong um, keep pushing forward and stay positive and um, talk to the ones that you love the most and they will help you and I'll, I'll and then I'll even help you you just gotta reach out to me so um, yeah so anyways guys um, I felt like I had more to talk about about this type of, of subject but um, I'm can't really think of anything else right now so um, but uh, yeah, just, just remember to stay positive. Um, keep keep pushing for it because you can do this. You know, um, like there's there's no point on quitting. It's not worth it. Trust me, I've been there. There's no point on why you should quit and you should never quit. And I'm not gonna quit either. So, um, anyways, guys. So I love you guys with all my heart. Um, you guys have really, you know, helped me keep making videos and. I am so grateful for my friends and family that have helped me through so much and um, they also inspire me to keep doing YouTube too so that's why I'm still, you know, still doing what I do so um, and um, I just want to say thank you guys so much for li li listening and um, yeah, just, just remember to stay positive, keep, keep pushing forward, talk to the ones that you love the most, they will help you. I'll, I'll even help you, you just gotta re re reach out to me. I know I'm repeating myself, but um, just I just need you guys to know that. So, um, yeah, so, I, lo I love you guys. Um, I will get better with my, with, you know, with my mental health and whatnot, and um, I, I will be trying to see things more positively, and I, I sh and then I hope to be better soon in no time. But it's 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 no excuse for me to stop do making videos and whatnot. It, it's really no excuse. So that I'm going to continue making videos. I'm going to stay positive and see things in a different perspective. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video. I, I love you guys with all my heart. I, it's, yeah, yeah. There we go. Can you guys see the heart? Uh, it's kind of a bad heart, but anyways. I love you guys. Make sure to like, comment, and, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you guys. Stay strong. Stay positive. Talk to the ones you love. Talk to me if you need it. Just reach out to me. And now I'll respond as soon as I can. All right? All right, guys. Peace. Love you guys. Remember we remember I, what I said. I mean it. Okay? I mean it. All right. Good deuces, guys.